Let's look at the difference between ordinal and nominal level data. So again, for ordinal level data, you have to be able to put the groups in some sort of order. For nominal level data, all you're really doing is just putting everything in groups. They don't have to be in any particular order. Of course, if you have ordinal, then you also have nominal, because if you've got groups in order, then in particular you've got groups. But there's sometimes when you put things in groups and there's really no good way to put them in order. A simple example, if we go to biology, the living things, well, there's animals, and there's plants, and fungi, uh, protozoa, and bacteria. Well, those are the five things in the world, but there's really no good reason to say that one of them's first, one second, one third, anything like that. It's just here are the five groups. All right. What does that mean for us statistically? Well, if you remember, for ordinal level of data, we can take a median. For nominal level of data, well, if there's not any order, there's no way we can tell which one in, is in the middle. The only thing we can do for nominal is just take the mode. If I tell you the average living thing on the earth is a bacteria, well, that's all I'm really saying is that there's more bacteria than there are anything else. That's best we can do. In terms of what can you do statistically with nominal level data, pretty much nothing. So if all you have are groups, you can't do any statistics. I mean, all you can say is which group is the biggest. You can't do any sort of predictions, nothing. So, in this class or in any class, you'll never really do statistics with nominal level of data. Again, we said in the last video, for ordinal level, you can still do plenty of stats. We won't actually do it in this class, but you, there are statistical techniques that use the median instead of the mean. But there's really nothing you can do statistically to say anything about the mode. So. From a statistical standpoint, nominal level of data, that classification doesn't really get you anything.